briefly talk about what's going on in Nigeria currently. So if you're an influencer or you're wanting to get into Ifa, everyone knows Ifa is the rage. But what I've noticed a lot, if you look at my initiation photos that I, um, for my last trip in Africa, I spent six months there and I took a lot of photos, took a lot of videos. Um, I had five different priestesses and two Wabalaos. So there was aesthetic differences between people from Abiy Kuta or from Ogun State or from Oyo, Ile Ife, etc. And each Arisha has different um, painting. Now, so when I see certain people getting initiated, even in the more popular tourist areas as for Oshoko or for Oshun, I'm seeing some very disturbing things. I'm seeing one, everyone's being given this beaded Oshun necklace, even though there's different paths to reach Oshun, depending on the region. Um, you may have white and yellow. You may have yellow and gold. You may have all gold. You may have um, um, yellow and coral. You may have yellow and green, or you may have yellow, green, and coral. But what I've never seen is this so you always have to get your head painted with Oshu and usually it's down to your um, shoulders and your arms it should be the whole body especially if you're in the Abiyakuta um, style but blue pigment is not used um, white made from kaolin clay called Efun that's used as well as Osun which is the red camwood you see there's barely anything there. This is something that's more done for um, Olokun or Obaluaye, sometimes Nana, but definitely not for Oshun. I'm seeing a lot of people just doing basic, just um, tic-tac-toe, a polka dot, dots, and Oshun has specific symbols. Um, I'm seeing a lot of people getting basic ass initiations. They're, um, I even saw with, it was like Juju Bay, her, she showed her initiation and everybody was wearing dresses instead of the sheet and they were going to the river. Everybody was wearing the basic Oshun, um, necklaces and it was very interesting because I've never seen it and I was talking to the Ifa priests about it. And they're all saying the same thing. They're like, that's interesting. And, you know, it wasn't like that a couple years ago, five years ago. So I don't know why it started changing, but you have to be careful. Look at previous pictures of your initiators. Um, if there's a major difference between other people got initiated by your house and how you got initiated, you might want to ask why. Because um, certain things are supposed to be done. In certain time frames, everyone starts. What no matter what a research tradition that you start in, everyone's pretty much supposed to start out the same on the first night, and in the first day, and then the differences go within the lineages and the traditions of what happens during the rest of the week. But and also, everybody knows that once you're done with the initiation, you're changed into new clothes, and you're supposed to look a certain way. No matter, despite the tradition. But yeah, a lot of bullshit going on.